So 1c, we just factor this with what I call the short method, and you can see the extra video to learn how to do this. But all you do is you list the pairs of factors of 12. 1 times 12, 2 times what? 2 times 6, does 3 go in there? 3 times what? 3 times 4 gives 12, and 4 times 3 gives 12, and I'm kind of back to where I started, so I've gone for far enough. Now you find two numbers that multiply to give 12 and add to give 7. What two numbers multiply to give 12 and add to give 7? If you look at the 3 and the 4, right? A positive 3 and a positive 4. Add them, you get 7. Multiply them, you get 12. Right? So then you just put the x in the corner like this and you write in plus 3 and plus 4. Oh, sorry, plus 4. Whoops. And that is the correct answer. x plus 3 times x plus 4. Now let's check that. x times x. Or so I'll just write out x plus say It's x plus 3 times x plus 4, right? x times x, x squared. x times 4, 4x. 3 times x, 3x. 3 times 4, 12. And add like terms. And we have x squared plus 7x plus 12, right? 